Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Is this it, guys? Are we going to finally finish the park game missions? Are we gonna finally get our diamond black buck? I'm running. Oh my gosh, my. Oh my wind. I'm just running the coast of Parquet because I feel like I just didn't do a good job and oh am I glad that I did. Oh, 119 to 136, 132 is diamond. Holy cow, I have the 243 pistol, that's what we're gonna use. It's an hour left in their drink zone. I'm right here on the coast. I have run this whole coast today. Just kind of checking, you know? Holy guacamole. So, for those of you who didn't see it, I shot a level 5 on my map and it trolled. It was smaller than a level 4 that I had shot. It was like 129 or something. <sighs> I don't know if this is going to make diamond. It could troll. But I gotta shoot it. Oh my gosh. Is this gonna be it? I'm pretty confident with the 243 pistol at a longer range as well. But also, I don't wanna mess this up. <laughs> Is that thing tall enough? It's certainly wide. But I don't know. I don't. I don't know. I kinda want it to just like stop so I can shoot it. Will you stop moving? My hands are sweating. <laughs> I can't believe- This is only the second time I've seen a level 5, too. I will be so sad if it trolls. I would love to know where he's going. Where is he? Oh. He's calm. Is that- is that your spot? <gasps> That's his spot, I think his, is his butt facing us? Yeah, yeah, his butt's facing us. That's an awful angle. I wanna try and get broadside. Uh, thankfully our wind is better now. Where is this guy? Oh, there he is. He's calm. All right, he's still calm. Which way is he facing? He's facing away. We can get broadside here. Okay, my wind is still good. Which is nice. I think I'm pretty much broadside. Oh man. This freaking long grass though. <laughs> I can't see anything. I'm just gonna take it low and slow here. There it is. Right, gotta get a little bit over here just because there's still some things in our way here. That's actually perfect, I think. Uh, to 100. Oh, he's going down? Okay. Whew! I was gonna say he was just putting his head down, but I think we were good. Okay. Holy. I think that was a good shot. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I hope this thing doesn't troll. I mean, there's a window for it to troll because it was 119 to 136. Oh my gosh, let's go! Oh my gosh! It's the top of his estimate! Oh my gosh! Tax that right now! Oh my gosh! Let's franken go! Holy cow! Oh, I'm shaking. 132.26 is diamond. You know what this means? You know what this means? I just completed the Parque Fernando missions as well. Oh my gosh. This has been... I've been looking for one of these since 2021. No joke. Holy cow. <laughs> oh my gosh. No way. I didn't think I'd ever see one of these. Oh my gosh, I'm shaking. Oh my gosh. Seriously though, night hunting and everything. Oh my gosh. 
which also means we get to go put him in the lodge. <laughs> we get to go put him in the lodge. Uh, all right, let's go put our black book in there. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So a quick recap while I'm changing the time here. The Parque Fernando missions are to get a diamond of every species to complete the missions. And so let's go through. We got um, our mule deer, water buffalo, red deer was the most recent, axis deer, um, I think the teal might be up here. Uh, kitty cat, teal. Also, what's cool, um, is I did actually shoot a gray one, so that's cool. But I found this level three teal while I was waiting for the level nine water buffalo to come in. But now we finally can place our black book. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Are those, are those, are those the true horns? Cause no one else has true racks except for the water buffalo. And just like that, it's over. Just like that, we've completed all of the missions. Ah, oh, we've completed all of the missions. One of the last side missions. It's time to replace this black buck, which was a level four, and get our diamond up here, which will complete my Parque Fernando wall. Oh my gosh. Whew. Oh goodness. There he is. Now this is like bittersweet for me. This is this is beyond, you know, the Parque Fernando missions because um I mean, I set out back in 2021, I set out to get a diamond black buck for the Parque Fernando mission. And I didn't even check any multiplayers or anything because I just, I needed this black buck to be from my map for that mission. If I was gonna have a diamond black buck, it was gonna be for that mission. So I didn't ever check any multiplayers, nothing. And I thought I was gonna have to start a grind to try and get a diamond black buck to finish the mission. And I thought I would, you know, it was for a while there, it was just the red deer and the black buck that I had to finish. And then I got the red deer, I found it on my map. And then it was just the black buck. And it's kind of bittersweet that it's finally over. But what makes it more bittersweet to me is that I think about a, over a year ago, my first video in which I did a voiceover while I was hunting was shooting that level four 130 scoring black buck I just took down. That was the video that kind of opened up the door for me to feel comfortable to do voiceover and commentary while hunting and in my videos. Prior to that, I had uploaded silent hunts and lodge tours and Sims tours that had my voice in it, but I hadn't done commentary while hunting. And that was like the first time I did a fully fleshed out commentary hunt. So to come back over a year later, finally getting this diamond, Black Buck, finishing the park game missions, which is closing a chapter in itself, but as a monetized content creator on YouTube as someone who streams regularly on YouTube and streams this game is kind of it's kind of surreal I'm not gonna lie like I I was thinking about it and I was really excited and I've been sitting on this diamond 
black book. I haven't told you guys uh, as of right now. Only a few people like my mods, but no one else knows about this diamond black book. And so it is more surreal to me than I anticipated. Like just thinking back that a year ago, over a year ago, I was just making videos as a hobby and now I get paid for them. <laughs> like, and I didn't even think back a year ago that I would ever get monetized. That wasn't a goal. That wasn't something I had set my set sights on and I still am enjoying it as a hobby and I love streaming for you guys. So this black buck kind of symbolizes like a year in review. I'm just so happy that I get to share trophies like this. My first diamonds of species, my great one. I get to share it all with you guys and you're willing and wanting to watch it, which I really appreciate. And I can't wait to get more trophies with you guys. And I have uh, 28 diamonds that I don't have, so we can go on that trek and then of course the great ones I don't have and the new species coming with Australia. I'm just super excited to continue to share it with you guys and I just want to thank you. So if you've made it this far in my rambling, please consider liking the video and subscribing to the channel for future content like this. I promise I'm not usually this uh, gushy over a trophy but this one was special so consider subscribing for more content like this and to see when i go live i stream nightly usually <laughs> between the times of 11 p.m est and 2 a.m est we play call of the wilds uh call of the angler these days the sims and arc most of the time and then we're throwing some first person shooters into there as well and i hope you have a good day Bye.